Okay, let's look at the last two problems on this review sheet then, scrolling down to number 7. We've got 120 teachers in a school. It's important to read that number because the graph actually goes up to 130. But if you look at the cumulative frequency graph, it does actually finish at 120. So don't trust the numbers on the scale, because sometimes those will extend higher than the number that you've actually got in your study. Always look at where it goes up to, and it goes up to 120. Just keep that in mind. You've got 120 teachers. All right, here we go. We need to write down the median age. Well, the middle between 0 and 120 is 160. So we'll draw the line across to 60. You should use a ruler, of course. And then trace it down. And it looks to be like we're at approximately 46. So the median age is 46 years old. The interquartile range, so halfway between the median and the max of 120, is 90. So we'll trace across a line at 90, and trace down to see where it meets the bottom. Looks to get there at around 53. Sorry, I haven't drawn that very neatly. So 53 is the top half, uh, the middle of the top half. And for the interquartile range, I need to subtract the middle of the bottom half, the first quartile or the lower quartile. Halfway between 0 and the median of 60 is 30. So let's come across and then straight down. That's obviously 37. 53 minus 37 gives us 16 years as the interquartile range. And it's told us that the youngest teacher is 21 and the oldest is 72. So we need to make a box and wisp plot. So let's plot first of all our median at 46 and then our upper quartile at 53 and then our lower quartile at 37 and complete the box, and then extend the whiskers out to the max and the min. We've got a max at 72, and we've got a min of 21. And that's your box and whisker plot. Again, we do not need to worry about outliers. And lastly, number eight. So these are the numbers of words for an extended essay. We need to draw a histogram in the grid for this data. So between 3,200 and 3,400, we had a frequency of 2. So a frequency of 2, there it is. Between 3,400 and 3,600, we had a frequency of 5. Between 3,600 and 3,800, that occurred with a frequency of 8. Between 3,800 and 4,000, that occurred with a frequency of 17. And between 4,000 and 4,200 occurred with a frequency of 3. And there's the histogram. Part B, the modal group is the one that occurred the most frequently, and according to the notation they've used, where W is in between 3,800 and 4,000. Let's write it down in that notation. The modal group, the one that occurred the highest, the most frequently, is W greater than or equal to 3,800, but less than 4,000. And that completes the review sheet. Good luck on your quiz.